in today's video we will be going over how to replace a motor position sensor, also commonly referred to as a rotation sensor or speed encoder. We will be working on the end of the motor. This process can be done with the vehicle on the ground, but if you're able to raise the vehicle it will make this process easier. It will also help to remove the tire, so here we're going to remove it and get it out of the way. Here you can see the electric motor brake on the end of the motor. The position sensor we're replacing is sandwiched in between the motor and the electric motor brake. There are three T30 Torx bolts that must be removed here. We won't touch the other two smaller T25 bolts. After removing those, the brake will come off. Ensure to catch the three bolt spacers as to not lose them and unplug the two pin connectors so you can set this aside. Now we can just pull off the rubber seal and slide off the magnet plate. Now grab some snap ring pliers and remove the snap ring holding the gear onto the motor shaft. Once off, you can carefully remove the gear from the motor shaft. Be careful as to not force these parts as they're precisely machined and the smallest damage can prevent them from going back on. Next, remove the four bolts holding the spacer plate. Now you will have four more bolts holding the motor position sensor in place. Once those are off, the motor position sensor will be free. You'll just have the two small Allen screws on the side seen here, and then make sure to unplug it. Now you can connect your new sensor and just reverse the process to install it. Thank <laughs> you.